How dare you? How dare you? Not you. This game. It has crashed. Okay, so I got it right here. Can I honestly with the first API? Sorry for lack of recording this guy. Oh, what do you know? Derpasaur is in Google searches. Yeah. now so I can start recording once more PSF PS created back to crypto there's a mountain climber Rommel are you a mountain climber yeah it's fixed he's Rommel king of the rock yeah well this game's about to get a new surfer No password for you? Oh, I guess we don't really need one, do we? No, sir. Too many mods for that. Okay. Have a beer right back when I get a snack. I'd be amazed if someone has all the mods of Scooby-Doo. <laughs> Consider yourself usurped, Trommel. I am the king of the rocks now. Forever watch the city as you try to climb this rock. Rommel, you were here at the end yesterday, right? Yep. What happened? What was the last thing that happened that you remember? A little chaos is what happened. We kind of ran out of people and Friedrich just ended the mission. Before that? Mm, I don't know. We escaped. Something I forgot why we were trying. Did you to have escape. any help escaping? We had a cruise missile, yes, and we had the help of the United States Navy. I forgot. I can't hear you from far away. We had the help of the United States Navy. There you go. That's what I wanted to hear. Hi, Kakashi Sensei. And greetings, Senpai. Hey, that's me. Hey, Senpai. Uh, hello. You fucking Sindre. <laughs> you mean Yandere, Senpai? Oh, Yandere, right, yeah. I'm back. I can kill you right now, Senpai. Why would you, you kill me? me? The whole point is not to kill me. Then I can ride your bones for as far as far as I want. Oh, God. <laughs> that That's a good point. <laughs> I probably shouldn't cringe while uh, laughing. Uh, no, you'll probably die. If Senpai notes me, I can die happily. Yep. Go ahead and uh, jump on your hopes and dreams there. Let's hope. Okay, Senpai. Let's hope the M MC or whatever doesn't fuck up things. It's. Don't worry. Okay. I'll. I know. I have a way to make it manageable for now. Ah, terrific. Spooky. Friedrich, Rob's why is this still overburdened with buckshot and not slugs? I... Dude, I, I'm sorry, I just haven't had a chance to... fix stuff. When I have more time, I will... Put some more time uh, into the map. Uh, never mind. Test one, two, three. Hi, hi. Test ready, working, Jose? Yeah. Sounds we read you cool. loud and clear, Tripper. All right. So let's let's kind of get started. Uh, first things first. Go ahead and open up your map and look to the very bottom right corner and tell me what you see. I see, a I thing see of beauty. the U.S. Navy. George H.W. Bush. Jason Dunham. So, long story short, uh, the intel that you brought us, as well as with the help of captured journalists that were freed, uh, 
a lot of stink was released about the current situation unfolding in the country. Uh, the media has blew this up into a huge issue, and the U.S. president has also been keeping an eye on what was going on here. Although his position is still firm about not putting additional boots on the ground, he has decided to institute a no-fly zone for any government forces uh, in the uh, on the island. And he is enforcing that by sending a small detachment of the U.S. Navy to float 25 miles offshore from the coast. Oh, boy. So... As it currently sits, consider yourselves to have air superiority. You have the USS George H.W. Bush, which is an aircraft carrier, which will be carrying Navy planes, which can serve a wide variety of purposes, in addition to two destroyers with cruise missile Tomahawk capabilities. You don't have a blank check for this, however. The Navy refuses, surprisingly, refuses to uh, put any ordinance on the ground where there might be a chance of civilians or otherwise innocent bystanders. Therefore, any airstrikes or any support that would be called in must be 110% sure that it's purely military, purely government, army, or purely cartel. That's how we're going to lose hearts and minds for this operation here, is if we start killing civilians and collateral damage. The whole reason why we're here is because innocent people are dying as it is. We don't want to add to that number. So now that you guys know that, operations last night, uh, Fortunately, have led the pre some of the preparation for attacking Colomar to be obsolete. You no longer need to worry about the radio towers. And you no longer need to worry about finding a way to scare the government into not using their planes because they're currently being scared by the U.S. Air Force. However, the rebels are something that we need to discuss. Uh, We've gotten comments and orders from the brass to not trust the rebels. They aren't really what we make them out to be. As terrible as it sounds and as much help as they've given us, and as much help you've given them, this is a assistance purely of convenience, meaning we're not going to help them any more than they need us. We don't trust their motives. But in the case of what's going on right now, it's siding with the lesser of two evils. The police are still good. As far as I'm aware, as far as we're aware, the federal police have the right of it. They're just very undermanned and outgunned. Which brings us to our next point. Now that we've been given access to the extent of the U.S. Navy, we are going to make one of our first major offensives in this campaign. Since we now have air superiority, we don't have to necessarily worry about Lingor Air Forces. Not that you really had to worry them in the first place because it's all antiquated Soviet technology. Anyways. Please go to your maps, go to the top left most dark shaded box. That is a military airport. That military airport will soon fall into our hands. As we suspect, that it is 
purely military and otherwise bad, unsavory people here, we will likely be able to put some ordinance down before things get ugly. We are coordinating with the federal police right now, and they will provide us any assistance that they can. Obviously, you guys aren't going to take an airfield alone. It is one of their more fortified points on the island, hence indicated by the very dark shade of red. It's not going to be an easy one, but given recent events and the U.S. Navy floating offshore, I think it'll be a little bit more feasible. Frederick, just to be clear, is it FOB Eddie? Yes. Okay. The U.S. Navy is also being kind as to airdrop us some new goodies. You guys might find it to be a breath of fresh air. Uh, they were telling us that's some pretty nice hardware that they're dropping for us. So we'll stand by and we'll arrange that to be uh, shipped to you. Oh my. Yay. No goodies. New rifle. No more AK-47s. No so... Please, everyone, please take a look at your map. I'm going to mark with an exclamation point a military checkpoint that we are not going to worry about. You guys are going to do your best to bypass this. Naturally, once things start getting hairy at the airfield, they're probably going to divert some of their assets to the airfield from this checkpoint, but we are going to bypass it altogether. You guys will attempt to make an amphibious landing from over here. We have decided that that location would probably be your best chance of getting as close to the airfield as you can undetected. Nearby there are some bunkers with some armor and infantry bu uh, bunkhouses, but that port is generally untouched and you should be able to slip in unnoticed. There might be some AA guns that they've decided to place down which won't do them much good against F-22s, but nonetheless, it's all they can really mix up for uh, new circumstances. The attack will begin first light, so I'm skipping time right now. And I will be dropping NVGs. All right, get some sleep, man. Get some rest. We're gonna head out soon. Woo! All right, get your what little sense. You know, cuddle up. All right, cuddle up. It's an important maneuver. Can I cuddle with you, Pike? What about our weapons? Yes, you can. Yes. Um, the part me. We don't have enough tents. Oh, you see These are two-man tents. Mm, oh man, that was a good. Some part will never notice you, fool. <sighs> My hands notice me, fool. Josh Gay, Jinx. Now he's a Jimmy, I'm The first set of night vision from the gods has arrived. Yay, gods. I don't trust. I don't trust Fuzzy with that shotgun. Put it down, Rommel. Why did you put, put it down, down? Trooper? Hey, 
we're all friends here, right? Right? I can't lie, I'd probably shoot you for a Klondike bar. That shotgun would destroy you. Hmm. Shark so, watch the sniper. Pull the boat and provide for us at length and deep. Uh, get a flashlight for your map as well. Okay, please go back to your map. We've just gotten plans from the federal police. Can't even see my map. Uh, use your flashlight. Uh, get use a flashlight. Your, use your anchor, and then uh, you'll see flashlights on, on self. Pretty sure I don't have a flashlight. Nope, I don't have a flashlight. There's four on the in the box. Do -do -do -do. So it's got an LED or what are we supposed to be, or is that where the poop is gonna go? User joined your channel. Hello. Hi, Hendo. We're playing that one game. Ah, that game. I'll be there. You yeah. Have one? Yeah. yeah. Have you played with us before, Hendo? The, the last yeah. time, yeah. We oh. played last time, so. You were How here, do Fuzzy. You use your flashlight on the map. I'm pressing L. Fuzzy no, wasn't here for the second part of it, Carlos. Well, Fuzzy, you were there. He was? Huh. It's Brian Hart. Bad fuzzy. I'm here. Bad memory. I've been rather sick these last few days. Yeah, you you only made it the one half. So what do you guys need? We need a uh, laser gun guy. Huh. I just shot you. Does that mean there's a you are laser dead. on my gun? Shot you. Oh, no, I've been hit. Stop shooting me, I'm dead. <laughs> uh, what do we have available, Hendo? I don't know, I'm just launching our so. We could always use a grenadier. Please take a, a look medic. at the map. Yeah, we could use a grenadier. We have a medic, we have a shotgun guy. We have rifleman? No, team leader. Last have... time I was the MG and I weighed, uh, you remember I weighed 46 kilograms. We have a snatch gear? Yeah, bring, go through. We have an anti-air or an AT. Uh, guys, there's been an update to the map. So take a look at the map. This is what the police have given us. Their infantry is codenamed Caballero. You never pronounce that. It means, uh, well, Ron Hart can tell you what it means. It means cowboys. Caballero Uno will be attacking from the north. They will. They have a small little camp in the woods. They will emerge from the woods when you give them the okay. Caballero Two will be just offshore with you, a little bit ways to the north as a support squad if you need it. And if they can muster up additional forces, they will send another fire team from the east. They also have a old uh, Black Hawk helicopter that we've lost and given to them, codenamed Halcon 7, which will come to play if you can find and take out any possible AA measures that the enemy is putting forth. Me, there is it? also the police have also been bragging about a marksman that they have in their ranks oh. if you can clear out an LZ 
then they can land him on a tall building and provide you with uh, Overwatch. Pretty sure we should be talking about another marksman fired on. You don't care. All right. We are arranging for your special goodies to be shipped right now. Stand by. Keep trying. Hit Hell it. yeah. I'm getting you, pussy. I've been dead for a while now. Shouldn't you go shooting other people? Yeah. Dude, I'm not gonna lie. You are playing dead pretty good. I wonder if it works for the enemies. Do you know who's good at playing dead? I. I I'm die so dead. much. Lay on Rob, you're dead. How'd the rest of that uh, Saturday's arm up go? At the Broken Arrow. Oh, I remember now. You were there. God damn it. Damn yeah, it. I was there for the first half. Um, the second half was just disastrous, if I remember right. The whole thing was bad. Oh, that off was bad. I was there for the whole off. Okay, let's see. It went to... I remember now. Okay, so there's this big wig and another big wig, right? Mm -hmm. The job was to make the two look like they killed each other in a fight, because everybody knew these two had tensions. But um, the plan went really, really awry. Because the bomb guy, he set off a bomb in the wrong place, well, set up a bomb in the wrong place, and then walked into a building he shouldn't have and got shot, and then he stopped playing. So nobody had access to blow up the bombs anymore. And uh, <laughs> so we couldn't just take them out in a car bomb or something like that. Couldn't make it look like an accident. So we tried to to raid something, and that, that, that kind of went okay, and then the... And away you know connect. I have no idea. Are you getting an error? No error. I'll try and go get it eventually. Shortly. Well, joining through Steam worked. Yay. Does Grenadier spawn with uh, explosives? Nothing. I'm not sure. Spawn with grenades. Cause uh, is there <laughs> any of those radio towers nearby? Oh, we don't have to worry about those anymore, here, though. We got good no. news. Oh, really? Yeah. Thank so, you. um, a few missions back, I happened to save a couple journalists, and these guys helped probably. I know. Don't much, forget the driver. Anyway, these journalists eventually got off the island and made it back to the United States, where they made their case to the president. And he was so shocked and appalled about the, the insane amount of human rights violations that he decided to send in a, a fleet, a small fleet of... Uh, oh, he did it! Yeah, U.S. ships. Now, they're on an overwatch duty, making sure that nothing flies in this airspace. Nothing. Nobody gets to fly. Except for the U.S. Except for the U.S., because the U.S. can do what it wants. But it's mostly they'll be using, what, F-22s and cruise missiles, so <laughs> those get right away. No F twenty twos can take off of the carrier decks. Yeah, so we have a carrier and like two destroyers or something for escort. And uh those are off the map somewhere, chilling out. When the DLC releases they both see them. Now is that in relation to the uh the Friedrich to do those uh cartel just bombing the shit out of the rebels? It's uh in relation to a lot of things. And previous past violations that I've heard about. Right. Like I said, these journalists that we saved, that was some missions ago. Four or five missions ago, maybe. And they, uh, they finally made it out. Oh, that's good. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, the United States is putting sanctions on this place now and uh, helping us out secretly, even more secretly. So we're getting weapons packages. The federal police are being armed and souped up. They are federal police, right, Freedom? Yes. Okay, right. Uh, the rebels are kind of being left in the dirt here because uh, nobody trusts them anymore. They're getting a little too... Uh, red? <laughs> Communist, maybe? I don't really know. Nobody trusts their motives. 
at least not not our superiors. So we're gonna have to back off from helping them. If there's an immediate call for aid and and we're in the nearby vicinity and we can profit from it, sure. But otherwise, not. Nah. Stand by Help. for. Well, give me. There you are. Give me thirty seconds, Frigic. Don't forget to get your night vision. There you go. Oh, I got that. What's up? Oh, I think I'm ready. God damn, he's been dead already. <laughs> it's mutual assured destruction. We're both dead. Hey, senpai. Senpai. What? Right what? 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 Spin around. Spin around. Bang. God fucking damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Supply drop. Let's move to the supply drop. Hey, hey, Carlos. You guys know where the is. Just walk up the mountain. Uh. Mm. Don't just walk up the mountain because apparently exercise uh -huh. is important. You there, Carlos? <laughs> yeah. I guess you're going the long way. Walk up the mountain. Walk up the mountain. Not around it. Come oh. on, you lackey. Let's get Let's going. Water. Jesus. I think Fuzzy Steve is the one. Are you taking Lars' name in vain, boy? No, sir. I'm pretty sure for this combat mission I will be Jesus. <laughs> Why are you going to be Jesus, Rommel? Because I have the RPG. Rommel, so I beg to differ. As the hand of God, I'd like to just point my case <laughs> as Jesus. <laughs> you mean weapons of ass destruction? One dildo doesn't need to be promoted. I've been on five. I have like 25 KIE. Boys, you hear that? That's the sound of the youth class in this world. That's the sound of freedom. Oh, there you go. Look at that beautiful line right there. Sir, that's the sound of freedom if I have been That's the sound of freedom right there, boy. That it is, sir. That it is. Well, we got a strike there. Let's hold him to go. Well, we're here. Oh no! Oh, 
silencers in here as well. Sir, I enjoy the sounds of freedom that this stone makes. What mag does this thing use? Stanag? Yep. Yep. I think we're out. No, we got 163. We do. No more AKs, boys. Thank God. Oh shit, we do. I didn't even see that. Jesus, I'm just... Oh my... <laughs> for a while. There's a patrol cap in here with an armor rating of two, meaning it can stop uh, rifle rounds. Mm. Save this uh, so that we have it next time. You'll probably uh, do that for us. Alright, All right, gentlemen. Once you have your tools of mass destruction ready to go, regroup. I love the sound of freedom in the morning, too. Hold on. All right, one second. While we get ready. You need something blown up, that's what the shotgun's for. Oh boy. Three birds will blow up a house. Oh. Uh, how do you shoot the grenade launcher with the, uh... uh try control G to switch mm -hmm. your grenade selections. No, and press F. Oh, that might do it too. What, do I press F to shoot it? Or switch to it? Switch to it. So switch to it. And you'd shoot it like a regular gun. Ah. Uh, Is there any... Uh, squad leader, can you ask Washington if there's any signs of armor on the base? We'll do that when we're on the way there. Don't worry. Well, I'd like to know if I could... So I could switch from this RPG. It's pretty heavy. Yeah, I'm doing well, it is an airfield, so... Stand by. Just get back in as quick as you can. User joined your channel. Hello. Hi, Kobe. We're playing that one game. Come and join us. Of course. We got some updates. Good news for you. Updates. We did not get better helmets, though. Fuzzy, did you see this thing? You see what's fancy about this thing? Jesus Christ.
We're playing the pronoun game. We'll we'll get updated. It's as big as the gun. What? But Reinhardt, I don't mean to aim at you, but you're white hot now. I'm intimidated. So what's our objective, Reinhardt, while we wait? I'm sure thing. It. Yeah, we'll just recap real quick for anybody that wasn't here. All right, gentlemen, if you'll open your maps in the meantime, if you need a quick recap of what we're going to be doing tonight. If you look just north of our current position, you'll find an enemy airfield just north of the town of Haciendos, nicknamed FOB Eddie. This airfield will be our first major strike operation against the government forces in conjunction with the local police who have been assisting us for the last few months in this campaign here on Lingor. We'll be receiving ground support from multiple assets like Caballero 2, Caballero 1, and a possible uh, marksman who may be able to enter from the northeast if we clear out the area. We'll also be receiving, if I'm correct, air support from Harson 7, which will be helping us out. Our main point of insertion is going to be near grid 022062. We're probably going to head out to that island or maybe from the coast itself and we're going to create an, uh, we're going to conduct an amphibious landing on the point called landing point just west of enemy airfield. Uh, once we secure that dock, we'll move inland, secure the airfield and uh, hopefully deliver a nasty blow to the government forces. Now, most of the enemy reinforcements will be coming in from the south near uh, Camp Marfaso, which is a block, which is a, uh, a checkpointed area. And it's just uh, north of Fedora, uh, otherwise known as Hakuna Matata. Uh, it's the enemy to bring troops from there. And yes, that might be our ride. So let's get ready, boys. Did you guys grab some silencers? Uh, I, I got one. some. Hand? Yeah. You want to grab a silencer? I got one. You have a sound or a flash suppressor. Oh, maybe I'll throw that on. All right. Attach a sound and a flash suppressor to the You can keep the time. other in your inventory and attach it later. All right, guys, get what you need. We gotta go. Need a quick PP. Stay low. Don't get killed. Why is Carlos Robin, dead? Let's go! I clicked the wrong button. Need a quick PP. What? Yep. Stand by. Don't worry. All right, teleporting fire dog, teleporting Carlos. Carlos is not in here. Almost yeah. there. Kobe. Let me get my shit back in. I have to respawn. Squad leader. I'm in. You want a lightsaber fight with laser pointers? That doesn't count. Thank you. I am the Someone lightsaber fight me with a laser pointer. Have you tried turning it off and back on again? L. L. For laser. Or light. Okay, you want a lightsaber fight me? Let's go. Got him, Tim. Tim. 
Don't take that, that's vanilla. There's a curable parachute in case I go down. I'm bringing one right now. I'm gonna have to respawn real quick. My grab from there, so I'm gonna take them before they're out. <laughs> Fire dog was killed? What? But my assault pack. Um I may or may not pick up a couple of those or drop a couple of those fire shoots. I trust the insertion. Frederick, can you spawn me a night vision goggles and I'll be ready? Right in front of you. Okay, uh, Frederick, I'm ready for TP. You're gonna need to. Oh, nice. You have MVGs as well. Yeah, I found it. Uh, look, Kobe, look. Look behind you. There's better goodies in there. Oh, better goodies? Ooh. Ho, ho. Why can I take these overall? I am the machine gunner. Uncle Sam has been uh, kind. Yeah, I got the intel. Sam by pistol, is that able to use a silencer? Um, what is it? Shoot. Fire dog, you don't even have clothes on. 9 mil? <laughs> Reload. Like no. Put your stuff back in the box. Yeah. Alright. We're just gonna go without him. When you're ready, we'll teleport you. Let's go. We hop in. Alright, yep. Let's get out of here. Toss it up, ladies! Wasn't there a machine gun variant of the MK-16? Kobe? I'm back, I'm back. All right, let's go. This is Pagan. We're ready for takeoff. Oh shit! Fire dog still. Oh, he'll teleport him later. Right. Endo, get out of the chopper. Carlos, get off. Is that Carlos in there? Carlos, get out of the chopper. Eject, Carlos. Okay. I'm ready. 
there for two peaks. Also, I need night vision. I can read you. Who's ready? Who's ready for teleport? I am. I just need night vision real quick, though. All right. There's fire dogs spawning on a little island to your right. Are you, are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah. How can I get some night vision real quick? Steady. Well, these are fire helped a lot, actually. Yeah. Hold your fire, boys. Hold your fire. That's friendly. Night fish is right in front of you. Right in front of you. What? Fire dog, you have night fish and goggles right there. It's it's flying up in the air. Yeah. In the air above you. you know what I'm doing? Oh. I'm uh, it's on the ground now. I'm gonna take my chances of getting a court appointed uh, interpreter for Russian. Really? Yeah. Court? All right, Cold gentlemen, listen up. Ash, like North Carolina. There may be contacts in some of these Detroit. fortresses and bunkers. Do not open fire unless you are fired upon. We're trying to head for the dock, so follow my lead. Here we go, Godspeed. Hit down. Get out of the vehicle, Carlos. Oh, God. Why did you have to leave? You can't, you can't get out of the vehicle without your tail. Sounds like the all set four. Get out. All, all set four. Why don't we just like terminate this for We're approaching a landing point. Head to the left of the docks. I think, like, Aaron, you know, we should use the, uh, the fab team speed. Thank you. Uh, I just heard you though. Washington the Pagan, be advised you do have air supports on standby if you can confirm the targets and they are guaranteed to be hostile. You know what? I put down the laser designator because it was too heavy. So apologies. Alright, rally up. We have laser pointers anyway. No, you need an actual laser pointer. <laughs> I have one, but it's not working. You need a battery. I have the battery. All right. You? Listen up, gentlemen. Yeah. Should... Our objective is to help secure the landings of the police force so that way we can head inland and take out that airfield together in conjunction with them. 
So we're going to go ahead and make sure they have a secure landing point for Caballero 2, meaning we're going to be heading straight north. Let's go ahead and start moving up. Affirmative. Why we'll stay silent until we need to go loud. Keep your eyes peeled and try to avoid enemy enemy contacts until we give the order. Be aware some of these uh, buildings up ahead on your front and at your bleak are full of enemies. Copy that. Two enemies, preferably. Hey, uh, I'll bring up the rear since I'm going to You can see them on infrared. Yep, copy that. Spotted. Just keep moving up slow. Yeah, they're in the barracks. Go for it, gentlemen. Advance slowly up to the left here. bad guys. back at the rear. Multiple baddies. Alright, gentlemen. This first control tower is going to be our first target to hit, so let's make sure we're in position before we go loud. We could ambush them coming out of their barracks. That's exactly what we're trying to do. Be advised, Caballero 2 is be proceeding to land. Alright, let's not waste any time then. Copy that, Washington. Fagan beginning assault shortly. Also be advised, be on the lookout for armor bunkers. There may have, there may be armor within them. And keep an eye out for AA. And we got the RPG. We have an RPG and I think Fuzzy has explosives, you said? I've got explosives around with the shotgun on my... I can level a house in three shots. Copy that. Copy that, Fuzzy. Fuzzy. Alright, gentlemen, stand by. Hello. Get ready. How we'll advance up and begin. Gentlemen, I want a loose line deploying from me as we move in. Try to stick together in pairs as we clear out this small control tower. How about you? will be beginning their assault soon. Loose line. Yeah, just loose line as we advance. Keep a lot of spacing. Just spread out in pairs if you can. All right. On my mark, we storm. Get ready. Hold. Out of breath. Give me a minute. What was that, Washington? Be advised, it looks like you do have patrols based on where I'm sitting. And we be my battle buddy. Keep an eye out for patrols. Copy that, Washington. Uh, prerogative. Are our orders to actually begin the attack, or are we just simply scouting out the area? Just to reconfirm. Your first step is to scout out the area for potential targets for airstrikes. Oh, copy that. Understood. There's Just understood. In, there's a guy on the radio tower on the right side. On top of it. Alright. Well, that radio tower is probably not a target for civilians nearby, um, considering these are army barracks anyway. All right. Here. Yeah, but I'm not going to take the time to start clearing the buildings out so we can get spotted. Yeah. All right, I'm going to go ahead and mark these barracks as, uh, as target one. Washington, this is Pagan. We have marked the first target as a control tower and army barracks. The target's name is Alpha. How copy? Washington copies. All right, gentlemen, the target's been marked. Let's keep proceeding up the beach and head to the next area. Stay low and avoid contact. I am marking it on your map, the location of Caballero 2.
power line itself, they can probably crouch. Just stay low, guys. up at the rock right ahead. We'll catch a breather before we proceed. I'm on a rock. You're in a rock, Fuzzy. I am the rock. Pagan, when you're ready, you call check. Rock. I'm assuming since we're all just on the rock, we're good to go. Let's keep moving. Hey now, the heavies need a break. Okay, no, we, then we'll we can, wait. We can just walk. Alright, let's keep moving then. Time is of the essence. I can't count that high. Can you count to three, bro? Yeah. Beep, beep. Um, tanks. DPRs. Oh, yeah. Uh, one air burst. Anyone else have any eyes on important assets? I'm seeing nothing. Yeah. Negative. Just looks like some civilian buildings around the main base. I've only uh, relocated to the uh, back of the line. Say again, fire dog. There's a Ural on the road where that line is. There hey, are look at yeah, troops on the towards the muck thing then uh, cowboy cowboy two. Yeah, it looks like I can see troops towards cowboy two. I can uh I can see cowboy two on infrared. They're moving in. Copy that. Let's go ahead and get this party started. Everyone get down. Washington, this is Fagan. Come in over. Washington's here. We've made visual contact with Caballero 2. We've also marked target for initial attack. Go ahead and send in the attack. This is a uh, barracks and control tower. Caballero will attack once they begin, I assume. Or once they finish the bombing. Roger that. I'll radio into the Navy right now. Clear the area. Shots fired, shots fired. Uh, no. That was accidentally me. I'm so terribly sorry. They had been, uh, Good thing so you got a silencer on that thing. Copy that, Washington. Taking one out. Gentlemen, make some distance. Good job. Can you repeat last? I cannot hear it on this end. Take cover. Get away from the airfield and stay low.
What are you hitting? Get back, guys. Get back. The Navy doesn't like to mess around. Yeah, they've got fancy weapon systems. Mission Maker is cheating. Gentlemen, once those bombs start dropping, we're going to go ahead and rush Target Alpha alongside the police forces, so be ready. Target. I'll be ready for some shit to go down. Si, sí, señor. Diez esto por unos duros. You gonna get up in the ATC with that thing? Or with this? Mm-hmm. Mm, depends on if it's still up. Who knows if it'll be up after the bombing. <laughs> <laughs> I hope bubble. they hit those barracks nice and good. Oh, yeah. I'm Imagine all those bubble. soldiers sleeping. It looked like there were three or four soldiers in each barracks. Oh, really? How many barracks are we mark? A lot. Uh, I'm counting... I think there's like eight barracks. Yeah, eight. Is that target alpha? Yep. Mm-hmm. Oh. Go, go, go! Stand by, stand by for second okay, strafe. Stop, 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 stop. Stand by for second strafe. <laughs> Second straight, nobody, nobody calls that shit! Alright, get back! Steven? But you, wait, he's you up. called in both airstrikes. I didn't call in both airstrikes, no. I just called in one! Steven, call in Fuzzy, he's going. Washington, Washington, I said Fuzzy, only one, Fuzzy, I said only one! Fuzzy, no, Fuzzy, hold back. Fuzzy, Fuzzy, hold get back. Fuzzy. <laughs> Fuzzy. <laughs> oh, oh, Fuzzy, get back, Fuzzy! I'm invincible. Can you charge me? Stay back and open fire if you see anybody. Stay back. He said to stay back. Crash all the time. Be advised, we have one more coming in. All right, everybody, just kidding. Apparently, the U.S. Navy really feels like bombing the shit out of this place, so just stay right here. They don't look too allergic in the base. Apparently not. <laughs> they're sleeping, okay? Well, put them into the deepest sleep that they're ever going to have.